This is 943 Southwest 15th place, and it's a new construction house. Just finished up. It's on a canal, and it just looks awesome inside. So I'm going to step inside and feel free to follow and check it out. So as we're walking into the front, first thing I want to point out are these extensive double doors. Those make a lot of sense if you plan to move in with furniture or if you're like me and really need to get back to the gym. First thing that stands out to me are these floors. You basically don't need a mirror when you buy this house. So what we're standing in right now is the great room slash dining room over here. So this is where you put your dining room table. And then as we step over here to the kitchen, we've got awesome looking granite countertops, updated hardware. These doors that do that cool little stop motion kind of action. Uh, great appliances and a beautiful glass backsplash. For those of you that don't know, the name of this tile, this is your 24 by 48 Spanish porcelain tile. So, I don't know if you can tell, but that's it right there. I know it reflects so well, it's like you're looking at the, uh, it's like you're looking at the ceiling. Here's a quick shot of the laundry room. And we'll walk our way over here to the garage. Forgive the shaky camera action. Ah! So here we got our two-car garage. This house was built in 2020, so we got no worries about needing to purchase any new water here, any new HVAC system, none of that stuff. So here we've got our two bedrooms, bathroom junction. Okay, so this actually has two masters. I'll get you to the second master in a second. This will be your first guest bedroom. You put the uh, a kid in here or Keep it for a guest or even run your home office out of there. Take a quick peek at the bathroom. All right. So you have to buy your own curtain. Here's your second master. I only call it a second master because it's got your bathroom built in. But there's also an exit that steps right outside for when you decide that you want to install your own pool. Something else you can take a look at here in the master bedroom. We've got our tray ceilings. Those look pretty good. Okay, and you got Good amount of square footage in your master bedroom. So I'm still walking. I've been walking since I started talking, and here I am finally at the end of the master bedroom. This is the master bath. Okay, so I'm standing in the shower. My selfie stick's about two and a half foot long, and I still got room. Um, same cabinets that you've got in your kitchen. Okay, so it looks really nice there. Here's your master bathroom toilet. Nice, classy, and his and hers closets, okay, in the master bathroom. This one's a little bit bigger. This would be my closet. No. Significant other. Sorry. Listen, if you love me, you're just going to have to deal with having a smaller closet. So here we are looking at the canal and the seawall. This is the back of the house. So as you can tell, pretty nice view. You step right outside, cast a line. You got a shark gator free canal here, okay? Got my water to realtor. Just kidding. There's probably gators. Just checking out the backyard. It looks like we'll see an alligator in its native habitat. As always, thanks everybody for watching. Feel free to like, share, and subscribe if you're enjoying the content. I plan to do about two or three of these per week. So I'll see you next time. Thanks.